Hey there ladies and gents of YouTube, this is MyCray, and I'm coming at you with another world premiere, premiere of a new deck on my channel. Um, so Bree, as you guys know, only has ever played Ghost Tricks, and she's bugging me to make her another deck, and I was like, what would you like? She's like, well, what are there? And I started mentioning off themes that she would probably really like, and this, and she's, right as soon as I said this one, she was like, do this one, do it. And it is Vampires. Um... Bree is a huge vampire fan, you know, kind of see ghost tricks and stuff like that. She likes the entire Halloween kind of stuff, dark zombies and stuff. But, yeah, so I finally got majority of the deck complete. As you guys know, I have a thing, have a knack of showing incomplete deck profiles on my channel. And I just like having you guys see the growth of my decks. So, now let's get started. We'll show off the three shadow vampires. Um, yeah. We'll do the three vampire sorcerers. This was one that we have been waiting on for a while to do the deck profile because we did not have a single one until today when I picked them up at the regionals. Three vampire duke. This is her favorite one. She just likes the artwork on it. She said that looks most like a vampire than all of them. Two Zombie Master to help out with your rank fours, please. Two Goblin Zombies to uh, get your searches off. Two Pyramid Turtles to summon from your your monsters. And from Secrets of Eternity, three Yuna Zombie just to give her that little synchro boost. Um, yeah. And. It, he'll, he can help out with rank 4 plays, he can help out with level 8 synchro plays, level 9 synchro plays, level 7 synchro plays. He can go in a bunch of synchro plays. Plus he gets, uh, he can help. Uh, originally I just put him in not just because he's a tuner, but his effect to dump from the deck to the graveyard for your zombies. Um, I was originally going to say Armageddon Knight, but before he came out my friend's like, Hey, hey, wait till he comes out, he's way better. Glad he came out like common, pulled like 50 of him. <laughs> One Tristan, Knight of the Underworld. I'd actually want to play him at two because he recycle. You know, he gets your vampires back from your graveyard to your hand. One Zephyros, the Elite. Um, just give a little more uh, rank four boost. That's it for the monsters. Now we'll go for the spells. Play three Vampire Kingdom. Uh, it's, honestly, it's helps out you you makes the decks plays go off better and yeah then we play three book of life this is another card we've been waiting on just to do the deck profile because i didn't i had a common one but then before she even wanted to play Yu Gi Oh, i traded it off now i have three of the sexy ultra rares that i picked up today and next up uh play three of the monarch storm fourth you are playing six level five monsters and you usually count on special summoning a couple of them. And uh, excuse me, by the way, that was nasty. And then, um, yeah. But this this helps you, you know, if your opponent has you in like a Jin lock or is gets over crap cards you don't want to deal with. Last spell is one foolish burial. Uh, probably will add a burial from a different dimension to this deck too. But do not do not have an extra copy of them. On to trap cards. Have one vampire takeover. Would like to maybe get her second or a third. Uh, just randomly like boom and like ah ha ha. Vampire kingdom on the field and just get ridiculous there. I throw in two mischiefs of the gnomes. Because uh, it can you know screw your opponent over and help you out. Because um, your vampires are level four. I'm at level five. But this you uh. If you open up with this and just a couple like a vampire, you just set that, flip it, and now you got in the next turn you got a rank four or a level four vampire. Uh, two call of the haunteds, uh, you know, help get your special summoning off and effects. Two memory loss and one breakthrough skill. Um, uh, honestly, Bree likes memory loss over she. She does not know I gave her a breakthrough skill to throw in there, but yeah, 
So she does like memory loss though. And then we'll play one skill successor. Uh, honestly, we're just looking for another filler card until we get the rest of the stuff we need. And then one double trap hole. Um, I honestly would probably rather have her get a bottomless or a torrential, but I do not have extra ones of those, so I threw in a double trap hole. On to the extra deck. The extra deck has about four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cards, so it's not complete. And these are cards that uh, I got for her, gave to her. Um, one card I already had two of, only needed the two of, and um, I pulled a third one, cause, and she picked out the pack. I was like, oh, I'll just put it in your vampires when we finish it. She's like, okay. And one card I had three copies of, and she's like, I like it. I'm gonna, I want it. So, yeah. Uh, Photon Papa Operative. Um, this is one that she really liked and she just wanted. She liked the butterfly. Uh, the one that she pulled for me, or I pulled, she picked out the pack and I pulled it from, was the number 101 Silent Honor Arc. This card is just too good. I gave her a Utopia to start off with. Uh, she doesn't have much rank 4s, and all the rank 4s I have are gone into a bunch, you know, my decks. So I gave her a, a Utopia just to help her out a little bit. On to the rank fives, we play two Crimson Knights, Crimson Knight Vampire Brahms. Um, all you really need is two. I uh, play one number 14 Greedy uh, Saramea. Um, this is a really cool card, it help, helps out with the OTKs and stuff. Uh, and plus, all the rank fives you play are, should only be dark because you can only go into dark rank fives uh, with the vampire monsters and so and then uh, we have one shark fortress helps out you know OTK it's also a dark rank five and the last rank five we play is Adrius keeper of Armageddon <sighs> yeah awesome guy helps out a lot and so far the only synchro she really has is a, gig, a gigantic castle which she can go into the Unizombie. Well, I hope you guys enjoy the deck profile. Leave a like. Let me know what you suggest down in the comment section below. And until next time, bye bye.